Welcome to everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss simple trick to remember seven crystal system and Bravis lattice from solid state class 12. From this trick, you can be able to write without any mistakes in your body examinations and competitive examinations too. The shortcut is C Tom there. So this is the shortcut to remember the seven crystal systems and Bravis lattice. Okay, let's discuss. Don't skip the video, watch it fully, otherwise you can miss the shortcut. Previous video, we discussed crystal lattice and unit cell definition. Let's recall what is unit cell. A basic repeating structural unit of a crystalline solid is referred as unit cell. Unit cell are the building blocks of crystals, a basic repeating structural unit. Okay, these unit cell are categorized by six parameters, namely A, B and C. These three are edge length of unit cell, A, B and C. These, A, B, these edge length makes angle between them alpha beta and gamma. The edge length B and C creates angle alpha and the edge length A and B are creates gamma and the edge length A and C makes beta. Okay. So totally A, B, C, alpha, beta, gamma, six parameters or six variables to categorize the unit cell. Among these six variables changing the values, we can get seven crystal systems, cubic, tetragonal, orthorhombic, hexagonal, monoclinic, triclinic and rhombohedral. Okay. These are the seven crystal systems and their axial distances, axial angles and examples of crystals. It is somewhat difficult to remember the angles and axial distances so that we can have a shortcut to understand easily. So this is the shortcut C Tom there. So from this shortcut we can understand the seven crystal system. I think everyone likes the cartoon Tom and Jerry. So we can give a shortcut the Tom based C Tom there. C stands for cubic and T stands for tetragonal orthorhombic, monoclinic, triclinic, hexagonal and rhombohedral. Don't change the order otherwise you can commit the mistake. Okay, right. Let's apply the shortcut to our topic. So first you can write the crystal systems based on the shortcut. Cubic, tetragonal, orthorhombic, monoclinic, triclinic, hexagonal and rhombohedral order. You don't change the order. Okay, right. So first we will go for axial distances, cubic and rhombohedral and first one and last one, the axial distance are equal, A equal to B equal to C, first one and the last one, cubic and rhombohedral, both A, B, C are equal. Okay, and then the second one from the last second one, male are the second and kale are the second tetragonal and hexagonal only the only the edge length c is not equal a equal to b but not equal to c okay both tetragonal and hexagonal a equal to b not equal to c and remaining orthorhombic monoclinic triclinic everything is not equal a is not equal to b and not equal to c so axial distance shortcut i think you can clear First one and last one, everything is equal. Second one from the last second one, only C is not equal. Okay. And then orthorhombic, monoclinic, triclinic. So all the three axial distance are not equal, have different values. Okay. okay. Next, next go for next axial angles. First three, cubic, tetragonal and orthorhombic, all the angles alpha beta gamma is equal to 90 so model moon me the pathana alpha beta gamma is equal to 90 degree okay and then monoclinic 
only beta is not equal to 90 so mono means one okay mono means one so only one angle is not equal so it is there is a shortcut mb mb means we can while we are using net we can use the term net uh, mb data mb so m stands for monoclinic and b stands for beta so monoclinic the axial angle beta is not equal to 90 alpha and gamma equal to 90 and beta is not equal to 90 mb okay right then triclinic tri means three okay the axial angles triclinic means all the three angles are not equal alpha beta and gamma is not equal to 90 that means that all the alpha beta gamma values are less than 90 okay E alpha has separate value and beta have separate value and gamma has separate value but less than 90 degree okay then hexagonal so from the crystal system hexa it denotes 6 so this is the largest number from the crystal so 6 means hexa here the gamma value is 120 degree gamma value is highest hexa one value is highest so there is a shortcut that alpha beta gamma rays you know very well the penetrating power of alpha beta gamma the gamma value is higher penetrating power of gamma rays are higher so easily you can remember hexa is the larger number so gamma value is larger number that means gamma equal to 120 alpha equal to beta equal to 90 but gamma value is 120 okay hexagonal gamma is 120 okay and rhombohedral it is quite opposite to monoclinic alpha equal to beta equal to 90 degree but is not equal to gamma gamma is not equal to 90 degree here beta is not equal to 90 degree and rhombohedral gamma is not equal to 90 degree okay so understand so axial angles the first three are equal to 90 monoclinic mb so beta value is not 90 degree triclinic all the angles are not equal to 90 degree that values are less than 90 and hexagonal only the gamma value is higher than higher only the gamma value is higher 120 degree and rhombohedral gamma is not equal to 90 degree okay so understand the shortcut okay now let's discuss the examples of these seven crystal system first cubic sodium chloride and zinc blend are the example of cubic white tin tin oxide and tin titanium oxide calcium sulfide are tetragonal rhombic sulfur potassium nitrate barium sulfate is example of orthorhombic monoclinic sulfur sodium sulfate decahydrate is monoclinic H3BO3 and copper sulfate pentahydrate K2Cr2O7 is triclinic. Graphite zinc oxide cadmium sulfide is example of hexagonal and calcite chinnabar and potassium permanganate are example of rhombohedral. Okay. okay. Now we are going to discuss the 14 Bravis lattice primitive and non-primitive cells of these seven crystal system. So for a cubic have one for a cubic have one primitive cell and two non-primitive body center and face center. Okay. And tetragonal one primitive and one body center. That means non-primitive. And hexagonal have one primitive. And orthorhombic one primitive and three non-primitive body center, face center, base face center or ECC edge center cubic center no solo okay and monoclinic one primitive and one non primitive and trigonal one primitive and triclinic and one primitive so totally 14 bravis lattice are there both primitive and non primitive this seven crystal system okay so in this video i have explained the simple tricks to remember the seven crystal systems and bravis lattice so it is very useful to your exam preparations please share with your friends and give your valuable comments thank you